guys welcome back to my channel today I'm going to show you some goodies I got I have a bag full of goodies um, some this is a collective haul some I bought on CVS some I bought on Walgreens or on Kmart that's the one so let's begin so first I went to CVS because I heard of a very good deal that they were having seven dollars all true match um, product seven dollars so I went and got my Lumi cushion so from seventeen dollars I only paid seven dollars so that was a steal um, the color and 3.5 I use it once and I really like it. It's very, 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 very dewy. So I set it a little bit with translucent powder, but I like her coverage. So this is gonna be like a mini haul slash review because some of the things I already used. So I can tell you a little bit more about them. So uh, moving on, I got this Magic Lumi Light Infusing Primer. I was crazy to get my hands on this, this, on this. Um, I'm using it right now under my foundation, mixed with my foundation, and I really like it. But I cannot use it two, three times um, a week, only maybe once or so, because it makes me break out. I'm very normal. I'm not oily or anything, but I don't know what ingredient or ingredients this has that just makes me break out a little bit so I use it once in a while but I really like it and I'm not going to not use it so and the last thing I got was the True Match Lumi liquid glow illuminator in golden and I can say I really like it I had the powder version and I really wanted to get the liquid version of it and both mixed together amazing okay now moving on I saw a, spe a special on these um, nail polishes and I'm in love with them I love them so much I want them all yeah like all I got them for three dollars. Where it was? CS or Walgreens? I'm not sure. But anyways, these are the Wet and Wild One Step Wonder Gel, and I love them. I have this one right now on my nails, and I had this. I put this nail polish about maybe a week or so, and. Um, they're pretty pretty decent still so thumbs up for these nail polishes this pink one is pinky swear this one is left maroon which it looks like this but it's really like a normal red nail polish and this one is pretty piece and I love this for me it's amazing from CVS I got a lot of NYX goodies. I'm color stuff, where is it? Okay. So this I bought um before the NYX things that I'm going to show you. But I really want to talk about this. This is the e.l.f. hydrating under eye primer. I'm using it right now. I've been using it for almost a month or two months. Something like that and I really 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 like it it's only three bucks and it helps with the creasing it prevents it and I don't know it's just an amazing your concealer and the powder and the foundation everything just looks so smooth I really really like it and I really recommend it especially for three bucks which is amazing so now moving to the CVS things that I bought I bought the Wet n Wire Contouring Palette in Caramel Toffee. I love this thing. It's super, super, super creamy, super, super soft, 
very pigmented. I just love it. Let me give you a swatch right here. This is the jello powder and this is the counter powder. And I just love it. It's amazing, it's very soft. This really highlights the under eye area. And this is, for me, it's a little bit warm, too warm for my, for my leg. So I only use it to give like a bronzy look, like a, not a sh uh, sizzle contour because it's too warm and I don't use it on my nose contour but overall for $4.99 which I paid with for this it's amazing so another thing I got was this e.l.f. HD lifting concealer I haven't used it, it's in the package still um, in fair but I feel like even though it's fair it's kind of dark. I got the medium one first and it was too dark. Even it was darker than my skin tone. I was like, mm, no. And this one is in fair. And as you can see, it's, om it's almost like my skin tone. Just a little tiny bit lighter. So I think I'm going to use this for concealing, concealing or I don't know. I'll try it under the eyes but I think I will use this just to conceal some spots or something. So, now all the mixed goodies, finally. I have here, let me take them out of here. Okay, since I've been. Um, oh, they're falling off. Okay, since I've been on the liquid illuminator bus. Um, I bought this NYX Born to Glow Liquid Illuminator and I really like it. I really, really do like it. It's like a soft pink illuminator, but it's not glittery or anything. I don't know if you can see it right here. Yeah, there you go. It's very soft and it doesn't have too much glitter or anything. It's more like a sheen, which I really like. Okay, talking about a sheen, I bought the high definition blush in soft, soft spoken from NYX, and I just love this color. It's like a peachy pink color. It's pretty pigmented, and it gives such a nice sheen. Can you see it? Right there. I really, really like this blush. It makes you look very fresh and natural. And I like that. More concealers. I bought the NYX HD Concealer in CW04, which is this one. And I love this concealer. It's a little heavy than what I'm used to, but here you go. But I really like it. I really do like it. You have to set it because if not, it's going to be a greasy mess. But it's amazing. It has a really nice um, coverage power. And it doesn't have talc or parabens, which is even better. I really recommend this and it's only six bucks. So. I bought this liner, I already used it too, it's the NYX Glide On, Glide On Waterproof Liner in Jet Black. I really like it, it's very creamy, very soft. Let me see if you can see it from here. Yeah. It's very, very, very creamy, very, very soft. For my taste, I like the Rimmel Scandal Eyes Waterproof Liner better because it's blacker. Is pitch black and stays on my waterline like all day. This one's much a little bit and it's not as black as my Rimmel, Rimmel Scandal Eyes liner but I've been using it lately and it's not bad. And for last I bought 
the Lix Lingerie Liquid Lipsticks in Baby Doll and Corset. This, this two. I like the color. I like them when they dry. I like them when they dry, but before they dry, I'm not the biggest fan of it because it cracks um, on my lines. Here are the colors. This is the pink one. This is the corset. Baby pink. Baby doll. Baby doll and um, corset. I love the colors. They're so they are amazing. But I don't know. I was expecting more of them because they separate in between the lines of my lips, and I have to be like this for them to dry. But and after the dry, they dry. They are very sticky. So, I don't know. I don't think I'll be buying more of these ones. But the soft matte lip stains, I don't know, the soft matte liquid lipsticks because those are practically liquid lipsticks. Those are amazing. They're super, super creamy, super soft. They don't crack on the lips and they are not sticky. I love those, but this one's mm, not too much. So well, I hope you like this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you on my next video, guys. Bye! I hope you like this makeup haul, drugstore makeup haul. This is all.